Big Chicken Morning Show on V103, the ATL's number one for hip-hop, R&B, and throwbacks. And as I told you, Capricorn season is all year round, no matter what you think about it. And one of my favorite Capricorns is in the building, Miss Mary J. Blige. What's up, Tigger? What's up, MJB? Nothing, really. <laughs> <laughs> Life. <laughs> I, I saw you frolicking on the beach for the birthday. How was the birthday? No frolicking. I was, I was living. As you should. Enjoying my life. As enjoying you my should. birthday. As you should. Good to see you. <laughs> Good to see you, too. So listen, this this song, this <clears throat> Still Believe uh, song, is uh, is running the country on the R&B charts. Yeah. As most of your songs do. Yeah. Uh, and at first, it just came, we were like, where did this song come from? And yeah. Why did you just drop this song out of nowhere? Well, the song, I, I wrote the song when I was fresh out of my fresh out of that divorce okay. because I needed to say something different and something positive other than what was going on in my life. Mm. And um, I had to believe in myself. I don't know if you listen to the words. I said, um, no matter what happens, I'm never going to give up on me. And um, it, the, the timing, right, the climate, you know, for for the song was it was just perfect for right now. Right. And so um I, I said people need some people need some positivity. People need to know that I'm not dead. I'm not, you know, dying. I'm not trying to kill like I'm good. I'm happy no matter what happens in life, you know, I'm I'm going to get through it. And I'm still believe is about just believing in myself and believe in not giving up on life, not giving up on love, not giving giving up because my life was so terrible. Mm. So but you know, and I, I just think that um my fans wanted to need, needed to hear that from me like she's doing all right she she's doing pretty good for herself and um the rapper that's on it that's my artist his name he's here right now. By the way. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah yeah he the man he been the man but you know <laughs> no thank doubt. thank god he you know he you know wanted to sign with beautiful life mm -hmm. and um he he's about to tear it up too okay. but um yeah the, the song is you know it's just something that i think you know my fans needed to hear and the world needed to hear from Mary J. Bly. Your music has historically <laughs> reflected the ups and downs of Mary. Um, was this process any different or did it feel any different moving on from the divorce and, and, and getting back to writing, you know, this particular song? I mean, it, it, the process was not so positive at the beginning, like in 2016 when it first happened. Right. It wasn't positive, but... You know, as you move forward and you move past things, you 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 let go of things and you you um you take responsibility for what, what you did and not worry about what they did and life starts to get better because you're doing the hard thing. Right. You know, you're you're forgiven and you're moving on, you know. You don't have to reconcile, you're just forgiven. Mm -hmm. And um you're forgiving for you know, I'm forgiving for myself and moving past all that stuff and, and working and, 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 and just watching God just shower me because I I'm doing a hard thing, mm. which is trying to do the right thing, you know, which is hard to do. Like, you know, being <laughs> being nice to people that hurt you and forgiving people. Right. You know, but you have you know, just bottom line is I've I, you know, I'm just moving past, you know, all the, the hurtful stuff and try not to waddle in it and you know, oh poor me and that I'm, you know, I I, I don't like that feeling, right. and I want to be happy and free, and that's what I'm working on, and that's what this is about. And but that, they and love yeah. them songs when you're not happy. <laughs> well, listen, I got them too, but because right. life, I mean, life is not always just one thing, mm. and and it's not always about Mary J. Blige. It's been about my fans. So, I've been writing songs for my fans and me all my life. So I got songs. I know how to write a song. I got I got one coming. Mm. <laughs> it's called Good Girl Going Forever. You know, and I said if you excuse me if you mess up, right. <laughs> if you try to play me, I'm going forever. And that's the story of my life, you know. Mm. It's like I'm, I'm, I'm beautiful, I'm happy and shit. But, you know, at the end of the day, you know, don't fuck with me. Don't, you know. And Fall I, back. I, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mary J. Blige in, in the building with the Big Ticket Morning Show. Uh, you're running through Atlanta. You're being honored at the uh, Urban One Awards. Mm. Uh, do these honors, like, okay, because you get a lot of them these days. Mm -hmm. Do these honors, do they still hit the same way? Yes, they do. <laughs> they never get old because. I mean, at this point in my life, people still honoring me. People still <laughs> want to hear from me. People still want to see me. Like, I'm just, I'm happy, you know? I'm, I'm happy that people want to honor me, you know? Right. That that my fans want to honor me. That, you know, the radio station is still messing with me, you know? Like, like it's, you know, it's been a long time coming. And I'm, I'm just grateful that people, you know, really appreciate Mary J. Blige to this day. Indeed, indeed. The Still Believe in Love is a song. Go ahead and introduce it. We're going to play it right now. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. All right, go ahead, everybody, go ahead. here it is. Still Believe. 
still believe in love right here with the Big Ticket Morning Show on V103, the ATL's number one fit hip-hop, R&B, and throwbacks. Mary J is in the house. Ticket, how you get a radio station with, with on, on like, camera? Oh, oh, this is social media? Yeah, this is everything. Uh, we we, we, we multi-platform <laughs> around here, Mary. What's this? We multi-platform, <laughs> Mary. Here? You know what I'm saying? We got, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, we, we, do, we, we do a lot of things around here. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta keep it well, moving we with the TV time. on the radio. I mean. We gonna see you on the radio. See that has never been done before. You gonna see Mary on the radio. You hear me? No, um, I know. I'm, I'm. Uh, Mary, we we've been here a long time. Mm -hmm. Is it still fun? Yeah, I'm having a blast. You know, I'm having a blast because I'm not living in 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 the old, and I'm not right. letting people keep me in a box and 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 pigeonhole me to what they think I'm supposed to do. Mm. I'm doing what I want to do. And what I want to do is like what I said on um, in, on my life album. I want to be happy, mm. and I'm doing that. And some and it's, and, it's, and it's hard work, and I'm working on myself, and I'm and I'm and I'm I'm doing I'm I'm having a ball. I'm having a blast because I'm not chasing. I'm I'm I, I'm living in my my you know who I am, and right. and I ain't scared to be me or scared to be my age or scared. I'm just me. I just can't help it. I, you know. I'm just yeah. Mary. Just Mary. Yeah. Just Mary. I, there's a yeah. song like that. Anyway, um, <laughs> you mentioned my life. Can you believe this year, 2024, my life turns 30? That's my baby. That's that's my second child. 30. My first child is what's the 411. Absolutely. But uh, my life. <laughs> Which, I mean, that song by itself, still one of my favorite songs that you've ever done, but that album turns 30 this year. It's beautiful. When you think back to the creation of it and the moments that were happening as that, you know, it led to the birth of your baby, what was, what's your fondest memory of, of creating such a, a, a timeless situation? My fondest memory was just being in the studio and I, I needed that moment. I needed those moments in the studio like therapy mm. you know those songs was like therapy for me and but it made me feel happy and sad all at the same time you know it made me feel happy that i was doing what i love and i was going through such a tough time doing it you know right. but i but that my my escape was the studio mm. to get it out so i mean it just i mean it was a it was it was therapy the whole thing was it like a specific memory that sticks out to you, like in the creation of it? Yeah, I mean, I remember. I always, I was, I was just playing the song the other day for me, me and Latanya for for our birthday. It was really for Latanya's birthday, mm -hmm. and it, we, I played "Never Want to Live." And every time I play "Never Want to Live," I, I think of how me, me and Bub was sitting there writing that, and and we was listening to, um, we was listening to it, and how I was crying, mm. listening to it at, at the board once we were done with it. And so I always think about that. And it was just the emotion of it, the the, the truth of it, like. It was just the truth of it. It, it, was, it was the 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 bridge. The baby, won't you stay with me? That part that broke me <laughs> down. I was at the thing like, oh my god. And and I was I was going through a lot. Right. And 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 Bob is amazing. He was he was always making me laugh. He was an amazing artist, amazing. Well, he is an amazing artist, right. amazing writer. He was our brother. He was always talking about he gonna scratch our eyes out. <laughs> <laughs> he was always sleeping with his eyes open, like he was snoring with his eyes. Like he was just too. He was he, Bub. Bub was just so much fun. <laughs> Big Bub, shout out to homie Bub. Yeah. Uh, but as, as you've uh, continued on to make music, and, and the evolution has absolutely happened. And so this new song was first the song by itself, but we have a new album in the works. It's my understanding. Yeah, I'm working on. A project. Okay. Something, that's, that's, that's a project. Something, something nice from something nice from my fans. Okay. Yeah. You you did the London thing and then you you came back. What what yeah. what, what lane? What, where are we going with it, Mary? What it sound like? What this sound like? Mm -hmm. This particular song, mm -hmm. and "Good Girl Going Bad," mm -hmm. it sound like ninety five up in this joint. <laughs> well, then that's where we going. Okay. It ain't ninety five, no, but I that's mean, but that's what the I energy do. Energy from it. This is what I do. Right. This is what I do. I, I didn't. I mean, I, I I tried the London sessions, which was not a bad thing because mm -mm. I love music. Period. Right. Um, but this is what I do. I, I make music. Do you do you feel the pressure from the fans to make a specific kind of music? I mean, you're an artist, and artists mm -hmm. have that freedom to do what you do. And but do you feel like that? I oh, I need to bring something back to the. I don't feel no pressure. I just go with how I feel. Mm. 
How you feeling now? I feel good. Sometimes I don't feel good. I'm not. I don't feel terrible like I used to feel. Right. But life is life, and, and and it's not just one thing. Okay. And it's, I'll tell you what the one thing is happening right now is Miss Mary J. Blige is in here with the Big Ticket Morning Show. Do not go anywhere. When we come back, we are uh, finding out uh, lots of other things. She got all these other things happening. She got labels. She got wine that I still don't have. It's all coming up. The Big Ticket Morning <laughs> Show. Mary J. Blige right on the People Station V103. The Big Ticket Morning Show V103. The ATL's number one for hip-hop, R&B, and throwbacks. And the queen is in the building, Mary J. Blige. Always good to see my Capricorn sister. Um, so okay, um, let's go. Let's go wine for a second. I mentioned the sun goddess wine. How's it doing? It's doing very well, um, and it's good. It's really, it's really, 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 so since really you good. For it's the good. Pinot Grigio and the Prosecco, sun <laughs> goddess, moon goddess. Um, mm -hmm. but, but then you're continuing on to uh, create further your your musical legacy with the label. Uh, Vado, who's on the song with you right now, is on the label. Mm -hmm. uh, but tell me about wine more. Why, why more? Ooh, they are amazing. Mm -hmm. They are a, a treat, a treat to work with. I mean, I mean, but you know, they're these are talented, talented people. I'm, right. I, I don't, I'm not just signing people. I, I, I just can't. You know, <laughs> right? If if you can't hold your own, and if you're not super, super talented, then I'm, I'm not dealing with it. And and um, um, one more. As young as they are, they know exactly what they're doing they don't need a lot of help right. they can sing anything they, they just can do anything right and um i found them on on social media okay um, yeah i don't even do a lot of social media but somebody brought them to me from social media and that's wanye's son and, and wanye's all his sons all his sons yes. wow that's crazy yes and they are saying sing and sang with an a the, these boys man they blow they blow me away they, they're gonna blow everybody away nice and then you have a, 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 I call him a veteran. You bring Vado to the situation, which is, you know, like, they were like, how oh, you got a hip hop dude out of nowhere? So, how, how did the Vado thing evolve? Well, Vado's been popping for years, Facts. you know, you know? <laughs> and, and it's it's just his time. It's his time. And um, we're family, you mm -hmm. know. Um, he He's Misa's friend, and he's my friend, and we're all friends. Right. And we're family. When we're family, you know, we all listen to each other's stuff and listening to his, you know, paying attention to him the way I started paying attention to him closely I was like you know what won't you hop on you know still believe mm -hmm. and he did and blew all my hair back I said oh <laughs> son excuse me I know I curse a lot <laughs> this is why we record things Mary I said I, I'm, I'm <laughs> I said wow he I said he this kid is it's his time right it's his turn and I could feel that mm. and um he's out of here he was doing he's out of here Vado! Right, <laughs> Listen to the homie Vado <laughs> in the background. Uh, so then this new song that I've been watching, you like, the, the, I, I see this came back with the uh, the good girl. Gonna you be act like, don't, you know what, Tiki? You act like that's not who I am. You act like you haven't been to a Mary J. Blige concert. I absolutely, yeah. Like last year. Like You saying I them. came back. What do you well, mean I came no, back? I'm, I'm saying, not. What are you well, talking I'm just saying about? in the music, son, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that's all I'm saying. It ain't even shade. I'm appreciative that it's still. What you saying? Back? I'm appreciative. Like okay. You wasn't just at it the has, concert last it, year. <laughs> <laughs> like I wasn't that strength of a woman again. <laughs> um, I, but uh, that energy is what I'm saying. It's the return to the energy. Mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. and, and tell me a little bit about this song before you introduce it. Well, this this song is actually a song that um was on the Good Morning Gorgeous album mm -hmm. that was supposed to should have been like after Good Morning Gorgeous. Okay. But um it it you know. Everything has its time. It was time. It's time. It was time now. Yeah. Remy Martin is on. Is on it. It was just time. It's just. It's, it's just time. That's well, it. Go ahead and introduce the song, man. All right, everybody. Here is gone forever, ladies. I know y'all ready for this one. <laughs> She's still here on B one hundred three. Mary J. Blige, Remy Ma, gone forever. Don't leave me. <laughs> What's the first thing that can make you leave? Lies. Mm. Cheating. You have a list. <laughs> that's it. Just those two? It's lying and cheating. That's it. Out the door. That's, yeah. Down the Good. block. Yeah. In the rover. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gone. <laughs> that is uh, amazing. Um, we uh, we we got new music on the way, and we we have a timetable for this particular album, a project. By the summer. Okay. Yeah. Summertime. Yeah. Be outside with the energy and the vibes. 
Yeah. Um, are, are we going back to TV and film and acting? Are we? Yes, we are. <laughs> Which we are. We, are is uh, my girl coming back? It, it's, it's coming back. <laughs> <laughs> The series well, it's, 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 coming, day outside. it's coming in it's coming in May. Um okay. the last season we shot is coming in May. Um oof. <laughs> can't say stuff I, about yeah, it. But season can't. three on the way like this. Okay. Yeah. No, no nothing? No something to look forward to. Nope. 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 She's stingy with it, I'm just saying. Um would you like to do more series or movies or is there a thought process around that at all or you just as things come to you and you're interested um i like i like both it's the same process waiting around <laughs> it's, the same, it's the same thing right um yeah it's the same thing is there a dream role for you something like a particular character or a particular person or like something like that i want to do that um if, if if it was a dream role it would be something like um nina Nina Simone because mm. I I want to learn how to play the cla the classical piano. Okay. And I just I just love her. I, I I love I love her songs. I love her stories. I did a lot of research on her. Okay. And that's that's something somebody give Mary a call cuz she's ready for it. Uh Nina Simone. It's my understanding you also have a brand new radio show speaking of radio show. You got your own radio show I heard. Mm, yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming for all of you. I'm, I'm, com I'm coming to shut you down. I can't sing, so how are you gonna take my job when I? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, uh, why? Why that? Why? Why radio? Why now? Well, why not? Okay. <laughs> why not? I mean, it's a way to reach out to people. Okay. Um, it's a way to speak to people. It's a way to get positive energy, positive affirmation. It's the way to get information out. It's a way to um, um, it's good mar to market things. It's 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 it's, it's a blessing. It, it was given to me. Right. Um. So you got the radio show. We got the wine. We got the label. She doing. She busy out here in these streets, ladies and gentlemen. Mary J. Blige hanging out with your boy Big Tig. Uh, I had some um some fellas ask me of a certain age. Some some. Where, where are you single? No. Really? <laughs> no. You're not single? No, I'm not single. Uh, you're happily doing what you're doing? I'm happily doing what I'm doing. Okay. And I'll leave it right there. <laughs> <laughs> um, what is, in, in Mary's, in your best case scenario, what is the legacy of Mary J. Blige? And my best case like, scenario? When you think about it, whenever that time is when you just like, all right, I'm going to sit down for a second. When how is Mary remembered? What is the legacy of Mary J. Blige? Um, I guess that I I I gave a lot. I gave so much. I gave my life, my life story. My yeah, I gave I gave a lot. I was a giver. Um, I opened the doors. I mean, what I've what I've done since 1991 when I came in has. I mean, from generation to generation to generation, it's, it still exists. Mm -hmm. it's, it's hip hop soul is um, super important. I've, 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 I've given women a voice. Every woman wants to tell their story now because I told mine. Mm. Any regrets? None at all. Not one? I love that. Nope. She is who she is. She said what she said. Mary J. Blige hanging out with your boy, Big Tigger. Anything that I missed that is coming up? I, I, where's the boot line? Ladies have been waiting for the Mary J. Blige boot line. <laughs> As, I mean, you're looking fly in your Javonchis right now, but I'm just saying, where is the Mary J.? It's coming. It's a thing? It's coming. It is a thing. Yeah, it's coming. So, because I, I, can I, like, get some for Christmas or something? Like, no. <laughs> Christmas? We ain't even going um, to production. For, we ain't do nothing yet. You like, said it's coming. I'm thinking It's I mean, coming maybe in two years or something, but not okay. right now. <laughs> they pressing me All right, about one it. year, one year, one year. Okay. I'm, they, I'm working it out. Okay. I'm working it out. 
I'm working it out. See, look at everybody. Am I working it out? I'm working it out. It's on the way. The boot line. Well, listen, sis, it's always great to see you. Congratulations on all that you've accomplished. Thank you. uh, All that you've brought to us uh, on a daily. The way that you've shared your life through music and the the emotions and and feels, if you will, that you've given us over the last 30 plus years uh, is irreplaceable. And you should be saluted and given all your flowers every day. I just want to say this, Tigger. Mm -hmm. Thank you to you guys to you, to everyone at V103 Mm -hmm. for supporting me all these years and for still supporting me and, 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 and break and being the first to like really rock with the record. Well, I appreciate you. The number one record. Still. You dig. Four weeks. <laughs> you dig. <laughs> Still counting. You dig. <laughs>